We waste a shit ton of time when things don't go according to our plan, regretting, mourning and distressing. This isn't the right way to look at life because in more than 90% of cases, things that you didn't anticipate in the wildest of your dreams are gonna be a reality. So does it mean we should live 9 out of 10 days in suffering, pain and agony? For people who don't understand the importance of time and consequently have poor time management skills, that's how they spend most of their lives. But for those who understand how crucial and important time management is all about, they don't find it particularly wise to throw down 90% of their lives down the sewer just because things don't go according to plan. The real thing is, when you are able to enjoy all the 10 days, irrespective of whether you win or lose, whether things go according to the plan or not, whether you succeed or fail. To be happy even when you're sad, that's the real kicker boys and girls. Events of pain, sadness, failure can make us learn a hell of a lot of things. They are our true angels in disguise as they help us realize our true strengths, how strong our resilience is and what we are actually made of. Who doesn't love adventure sports? Surely the level you prefer can vary but everyone would want to have a little adventure and there is no better adventure and life itself. The learning attitude is probably the best lifeline you have in this adventure sport. And exploiting this lifeline in the right manner can help you learn from both the folks above you and those who are below you without letting your ego take a hit. The primary aim of this adventure isn't to win but rather to enjoy the journey. If you are becoming better than yesterday, then you are living this adventure. If you are becoming wiser than yesterday, then you are understanding this adventure. And if you are becoming stronger than yesterday, then you are learning from this adventure. This adventure of a lifetime isn't gonna wait stop a pause for you it's it is running as we speak don't waste it becoming a pro in time management skills is an adventure in itself pretty easy to learn if you could inculcate the tips i talked about hence to conclude all this i would just say stop killing time before time starts killing you